is the key to success. When we imagine all the things around us, we can integrate it with maths. Everything around the world has a special mathematics on it. So, in this activity, we are going to integrate art with mathematics to study or to explore the hidden geometry found in the monuments of Kerala and Himachal Pradesh. Geometry. Everything around us has a geometry on it, even a small grain of sand. Think about the base. It has a very great geometry. So, what about the monument? Yes, it is surely an encyclopedia of geometry. So, as a part of our art integrated project, we are going to integrate art with the monuments found in Kerala and Himachal Pradesh and also a comparative analysis of geometry of the monuments in Kerala and Himachal Pradesh. So, let us explore the geometry in these monuments. Hi, friends. Did you know about the Kangra Fort? It is the largest fort in Himachal Pradesh. The Kangra Fort which is arranged in a cuboidal shape and they had a sequence in it. The square chambers were arranged profusely decorated with paintings. Uh, the front opening of the Kangra Fort in semi-arc shape which embedded with two cylindrical pillars. The steps were arranged in rectangle shape and built by stones. The massive wall has opening of square shape and they are arranged in a sequence of patterns. The Kangra Fort was built by the royal family of Kangra state which raises its origins to the ancient Tugata kingdom. Kangra Fort is located at a distance of 20 km from the town of Dharmashala on the outskirts of Kangra and Madhya Pradesh. The Kangra Fort is said to have 21 treasure wells, each well is 4, 4 meter deep and 2.5 meter in its circumference. This fort is spread over a large area via a 4 km longer outer circuit. The entire fort is guarded by high ramparts and massive walls of black stones. And the fort has total 11 gates and 23 bastions. The do doors are shaped on arc model. The first part. The first fort was formerly known as the Hiradi Fort. It was built in 10th century. Later, it was dissolved by British and by earthquake in 1905. We can find out so many geometric shapes like squares, rectangles, cylinders, and so on on this part. It, it has an average elevation of 643 meters. The native architecture styles of Madhya Pradesh determined mostly by the climatic condition and well natural materials. Nusa for uh, entrance is opened with two large cylindrical pillars. The outer wall is cubic shapes and uh, an open step well which is near to this fort. This fort was completely built by stones of geometric shapes like squares, rectangles, etc. Geometric shapes and geometric tiles patterns are used to decorate both inside and outside the fort. It also bears a numerous number of cone shaped structures in the top. Also had a trapezoid on the top which stands in a cuboidal structure. Hi, do you know the geometric structures of Krishnamurai Palace located in Alabra district of Kerala? The place is covered with a massive wall of rectangular shape. The roof of the palace is of the shape of a tetrahedron and in front there is a triangular pyramid shape. The inner entrance of the palace is in square shape and six pillars of cylindrical shape. The front entrance is pyramid shape which is placed on four cylinders. There is an open structure well which is a bit to shape. The very square altar is in a square shape. Thank you. So, now we are going to explore the hidden geometry found in the fort in Kerala. It's Palakkad Fort. So, let's find out to explore the hidden geometry found in the structure of Palakkad Fort. So, let's see. The Palakkad Fort has an arch bridge which is a three-fold building and also it had a compound wall which is a eight circular mounds and eight cardinal cones. The outer wall along the mouth on four sides is having a trapezial shaped machinery. The inner entrance of the mandaba is a square shaped mandaba and many sculptures are kept over there. There is an open steep well which is a ball in shape and it had a specified sequence in it. 
They have many pillared mandabas which has a rectangle heart and had many cylindrical pillars over it and its length is 40 feet and width is about 25 feet. There is also a guard room which is rectangular in shape which is situated in the front bar. So friends, we can see many geometrical shapes from this spot. So we had found that many geometrical Mathematics and architecture are interrelated. Architects using geometry for defining the spatial form of a building from the Pythagoreans of the 6th century onwards to create forms considered harmonious and thus to lay out buildings and their surroundings according to the mathematical, aesthetic and religious principles. From the very period onwards, Indian architecture was based on mathematics following the principles of Vastu Shastra which was based on mathematical calculation. Here we conduct a study about the influence of geometry and architecture from the monuments of Kerala and Himachal Pradesh. All monuments have its own mathematical beauty. We find out many geometrical shapes from the monuments that are tetrahedron shapes. Here we get so many geometrical shapes like cylinder, cube, cuboid and finding its surface area. Through this study, we can link with their concepts of chapter, surface area and volume. Thank you.